All right, guys, we're here at the Lake Country booth. Uh, we have the Udos for the first time. We're going to get to play with it. Excited. Right now, it's on 21 millimeter mode, which you guys know I'm a huge 21 fan. Here's the speed dial. Speed one. It has power. Speed four, it has the power. All right, we're here with Vaughn with Lake Country. Uh, we are on 21 millimeters. Now he's going to show us how to change. 15. So now it's at 15. 12. 12. Sanding or 8 millimeters. Wow. <laughs> and my favorite, rotary. Rotary, amazing. So when you have it in rotary mode, it's fully locked in. When we switch it to DA, now it's a free spinning DA. Wow, that is that is amazing. Well balanced. And you saw the power that you had. It has uh, power, correct. So when you have it on a 21 millimeter stroke, so we'll switch it over. And there we go. Switch it over to 21 millimeters. You can actually put a bit of pressure on this. So no pressure. I can apply pressure. And so I still have backing plate rotation. It never falls with that much pressure. I'm too lazy. <laughs> but there we go. Kudos pads have a very peculiar shape to them. And you'll notice this little divot here. Yes, yes. When we're polishing, some of us have a tendency to put a bit of pressure on the machine. It acts like a shock absorber to absorb that pressure and keep your pad flat to the surface at all times. Now, a lot of pads are designed for either rotary or dual action use. This is designed for both, because the machine is a rotary and a dual action. Makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Yes. So it's designed to take all of the all of the different orbits. Exactly. Awesome. All right, yeah, let's, uh, let's give it a drive on uh, rotary. All right, guys, we're in rotary mode right now. Guys, this is insane. This feels, this doesn't feel right. It feels like, wow. Look at the smile on his face. <laughs> this, is, this is cool, guys. This is the future. This is wild. <laughs> nice. Really nice. <laughs> Really, really, really nice. Pretty cool, pretty cool. All right guys, that was my first time playing with the Udos and I am impressed. Um, I was concerned with if it has a lack of power, with so much going on, is it going to be weak? Is it going to be easy to stall? But it does have torque. Uh, that's something that uh, the Max Shine just does not have, if that makes sense. So having that torque, being able to deliver that power to the paint is very, very important. So uh, I'm very, very impressed. The rotary mode was extremely smooth. Uh, the DA, the eight millimeter, the 12 millimeter, you are essentially getting five tools with one machine. So when you're edging, you could go to rotary mode. Uh, if you want to be less aggressive, you don't want a wider orbit, you go to eight millimeter. All those orbits have different advantages and disadvantages. So with this one tool, you could tackle all of those things to give you the ultimate detailing machine. I'm so excited to pick one up. Uh, I did talk with David and Jason and Vaughn and Bob, and uh, they are going to be available late March. Uh, I am going to be picking one up. Uh, if this tool is 500, 700, 800, think about it. You're getting five tools in one. It is worth its weight in gold. I'm definitely excited and I am impressed.